Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are watching the 2020 supernatural horror film called The Empty Man. So in the Ira Valley in Bhutan in the year 1995, four friends Greg, Fiona, Ruthie and Paul go hiking on a mountain. Paul hears a strange whistling and falls in a crevice. And Greg finds him in an almost catatonic state, staring at a massive and strange inhuman skeleton embedded into the cave wall. The group carries him out to and take refuge at an empty house as a storm snowstorm hits. Okay, this is something wrong because um. I don't think Bhutan snows. Okay, I take it back. Bhutan does snow. The next day, Ruti is chased by the spirit of the creature in the cave. And that night, Paul slowly possessed, is slowly possessed by the evil spirit, whispering something into Ruti's ear. The group later finds Paul next to the bridge. They cross. Ruti becomes dazed before stabbing Greg and slicing Fiona's throat and throwing their bodies off the cliff. She shares an entrance look with Paul before throwing herself off too. Oh dear. So now we go to the year 2018 in misery. A former detective named James Lazombra is grieving the death of his wife Allison and their son Henry, who died in a car accident a year ago. So I guess it's like the what do you call that? Uh, it's been a year, right? So oh, I forgot the name of the name of it. Is the year to the date as I in a memories basically. His friends he is friends with his neighbor Nora who is a widowed single mother and so Nora's daughter Amanda ran away from home and they found a message written in blood saying in a bathroom saying the empty man empty man make me do it uh, so James researches the penalty facts institute and see what the empty man is about and so the empty man that night he hears them and besieged by nightmares, he travels to the institute and sits on a talk by Count Lida, Arthur Parsons. Suffering from hallucination, James ambushes Count Member Jared and asks him what is happening before, before brutally assaulting him. James breaks down and finds himself in a limbo-like dimension where the entity enters his body the back in the hospital James executes Paul he finds himself surrounded by several members of the hospital staff and they all bow to him What do you mean if I touch you? 